Hey guys, it's Redneck, and I'm going to go over the really cool things that Rockstar will be releasing with its new Grand Theft Auto V DLC titled The Business Update. While you will notice some new business attire, I'll be focusing more on the vehicles, guns, and the possibility of another band wave. So sit back and enjoy a detailed explanation of the new Grand Theft Auto V Business Update for Grand Theft Auto V coming out March 4th. So guys, the airplane you see is the Vestra. That thing is most likely a 6-7 to seven passenger dual turbine small wing airplane. That thing is going to be quick, easy to maneuver, and get your crew to the fight. Or to the sky, to parachute like ninjas. The car on the right is a Grotti Turismo R. It will most likely have the maneuverability of the Elegy with the speed and quickness of the Entity. Price tag... Probably 800 G's. The red car on the left is the Albany Alpha. Looks to be like a souped up Chrysler 300. So basically a really fast luxury car. Sure to survive a few scratches, bumps, bruises. Maybe not so many explosions. But hey. So those are the three. Or the two main cars. And there is one other one. It's the Dinka Jester guys. It's not that great. But there you have it. My favorite part, guns. Freaking guns. Okay, well maybe there are some snazzy new clothes, but I'm here to talk about guns. Now the gun on the left is called the Heavy Pistol. It appears to be modeled after Desert Eagle, which if you've played a few shooters, you will know it is very powerful. Just not accurate. Probably a 50 caliber. The rifle on the right looks sexy. Plain, no... Not plain, amazingly sexy. Seems to be modeled after an HK G36, maybe the C line. Unsure, but it's definitely a G36 line though. The caliber is most likely going to be a heavy load 556 or 223, which is the same, it's just a few millimeters off. Or it's going to be a special load 7.62 AK round. While the 7.62 is stereotyped to be an inaccurate round, it's very accurate as it isn't so much the bullet that makes it accurate, but the platform it is shot through. Now yeah, we'll expect this rifle to be powerful with a kick. As with the Valentine's Day Massacre DLC, the new weapons and vehicles will be available in story and online modes. For story mode, the weapons will be inserted into the three characters' inventory with two full clips. The three new cars will be in their respected garages. And now in online, the guns will be available at ammunition for purchase along with attachments, guys. For the cars and airplane, you're going to have to go to Legendary Motorsport for the cars and Elitus for the plane and purchase them. Don't forget, guys, this is the last weekend to purchase the Albany Roosevelt, the Tommy Gun, and everything else released in the Valentine's Day Massacre DLC. Once you purchase them, they're yours, but do it before midnight Pacific time on this Sunday, March 2nd, because that's when it ends.